Hi guys, I'm Mel Michael Muntajes. I'm a hair and makeup artist based in Berlin and welcome to my YouTube channel! <laughs> For this vlog, I'm going to attempt to do my first ever drug makeup to myself. So I'm going to transform this look to this look. <laughs> So I will start by preparing my skin by using a moisturizer. I will use a moisturizer by Claire's. I like this moisturizer because it's watery and lightweight. In drug makeup, I have to cover my eyebrows. So I have to make sure that I brush the eyebrows hair the way it grow. So we're gonna need a glue stick, loose powder, and concealer to cover the brow. Apply the glue direct into the brow. Use your finger or spatula to make it flat as much as possible and let it dry. Once the glue is completely dry, I will press it with translucent powder. You just have to repeat the gluing and the drying until you get 3 to 4 layers. Next, we're going to conceal the brow using the Frolong Wear Concealer by MAC. After the base brow, I will use powder products such as eyeshadow to set over the base that is slightly deeper shade. Here, I'm using this matchbox in shade hang. I will use the same concealer that I used to cover my brows to correct the mistake that I make. So guys, I know it's hard to draw a perfect brow but don't worry to make any mistake because you can always correct it. For the eye makeup, I'm going to use a black eyeliner to curb out the crease. I'm going
going to blend the crease using a flat brush. I'm going to use the eyeshadow palette by MAC in shade Can't Afford This and I'm going to blend out the black eyeliner edge using the shades. For the outer crease, I'm going to use a black eyeshadow by MAC in shades Carbon and I'll just gonna blend it out into the crease towards the center. So at this time, I decided to blend some warm eyeshadow palette by MAC in shade Louvre at per side toward to the center crease. And I'm just gonna blend it because blending is the key. Using a concealer, I'm going to cut out a new eyelid. I will apply it from inner crease towards to the center crease. What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. And to add some drama, I'm going to put some glitters. Using the cream eyeshadow palette by Too Faced, I will apply it directly to the new eyelid that I create. Now I'm going to do my eyeliner. I'm going to use a liquid eyeliner that I bought in Primark for only 1 euro and 50 cents. It's cheap and it's good, so you should try it. What I do is I like to start drawing a line from inner crease toward to the center crease. And then I will wink it from outer crease merging the line to the center crease. After I finish my eyeliner, I'm going to put some fake lashes. Big lashes are very important in drag makeup, so the bigger the better. Before I put the fake lashes, first I will curl my natural lashes and I will put some mascara from Bobbi Brown. Add some glue to the lashes, and then the most important things to do is to wait. I'm going to pop it down the fake lashes into my lashes, and then I like starting gluing the fake lashes from outer to inner lashes. <laughs> Thank you. 
Now, I'm going to prepare my skin using a full coverage concealer and foundation. Using a black eyeliner, I'm going to draw a new lower lash line to create a big eye. Then, I will blend it using a flat brush. I'm going to use the eyeshadow palette by MAC in shade Lubre at first sight to blend out the edges. Between my natural lower lash line and the new lower lash line that I draw, I'm going to apply a cream white eyeshadow. And then, I'm going to use some individual fake lashes for my lower lash line to create some 3D effect. For my face contour, I will be using NYX Whip Wonderland. Basically, this product is a lip cream, but today, I'm going to use it for contouring. If I'm not mistaken, this product is already phased out in the market, but if you ever find some, you should try it. For blush, I'm going to use this Web Aquarat Spectrum in shade CRO30. For my lips, I'm going to use a lip liner from MAC in shades Burgundy and I'm mixing it with the Retro Matte Lipstick in shade Burnt Spice.
watching guys i hope you like my first vlog this is the drag queen makeup and please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell